Hello everyone, Ziggler here, Bork, Chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. Today I'm gonna show you something that it's kind of interesting, in my opinion, is that if you don't have blacksmithing on, like, at all, in Seasonal Discovery, you really should get it. And it's super simple, the, the way that I'm thinking about, like, you could do this. Because, first of all, you need level 5. So, in... If you're playing a, a horde, I highly recommend that you do this on a tauren. It doesn't really depend, like it doesn't really matter on the class. But I'm gonna explain to you why it's so super simple to to make money with this profession really early and very cheap. So let's say that I'm like a tauren, and I let me lower the volume a little bit. There we go. So. Let's say that I'm a Tauren, just healing, uh, like I'm making a Tauren or whatever, leveling it to level 5, then running here to Thunder Bluff. And right right over here, you have the journey, Journeyman Blacksmithing. So, the first thing that you do once you learn it, uh, you, will, you will be able to make the rough sharpening stone, which is super cheap to craft. So... First of all, you buy enough for you to skill to 40. Because once you are 40 in the skills, you can learn the Copper Short Sword. And if we go to Copper Short Sword, you're going to see here. Okay, the crafting cost is actually quite expensive. But like, what, what I mean to, to say with this is that... You can, you can, like, if you have the gold, uh, or, like, check on your server, because it could be cheap. It depends on the price of the copper. But the the thing is, like, I, I keep selling these. I've, I've sold 125 so far, with an average price around 38 silver each. With an average, like, yeah, like, the percentage is, is crazy. And, I mean... At the moment, it's a 41 silver profit on each copper short sword. And I'm pretty sure that you need three of them. And then you can, like, I, I've learned it on, on my alt over here. I dropped skinning because I'm not going to play on this one right now. So I was like, let me learn blacksmithing and start doing this. Because it's such an easy way to make some gold. And the crafting on it doesn't take that long either. So let's try and craft one and we will see. I need three. Okay, let's buy nine. That's perfectly fine. So on this character, I've I've made 160 gold with a with just having enchanting on it. Making the like minor mana oil and the lesser magic ones. And combined with the blacksmithing. Let's see how long it's going to take for me to craft one. There we go. Create. It's going to take three seconds to craft one. So it's not like it's going to take like one of those bigger tick items that's going to take like 30 seconds to craft one item. So if you have the gold, at the moment I, I keep like trying to have around like 20 to 25 copper short sword. Maybe 30 actually because that's like, what is that? 10 because if you need three that's 10 way late supplies but like try to find your sweet spot and if you haven't uh, got the auctioneer add-on you really should uh, get it and like set it up pr properly uh, let me actually show you the settings i i'm having so let's do like this i'm just gonna show you but it, it, it's it's super simple to actually like having to to just have blacksmithing on a very early level, and like this thing sells. I mean, look at last sold one day and four hours ago, and I only expired since uh, like okay, expired since last sale. Yeah, nineteen. True, but I mean it's it. it Sometimes they fly off the auction house. And in my opinion, it's kind of worth to have 
a few on the auction house. Just just on this one. So yeah, th this is just a small little tip that I, I've been doing. And after that, I mean, there, there's probably... I, I think the... Yeah, after you get uh, high enough on the next one... Let's see here. Let's go to pants. So once you have 45 after that, you can craft the ruined copper... The ruined copper pants, which is also a part of the Waylight Supplies. So let's see here. Last sold one day, 10 hours ago. People are still buying these. Just to scale up. I mean, 20 silver for... Oh, see? 40 silver profit per craft. And people are still buying these. And I'm pretty sure there is a waste, right? I don't know, maybe it was... I don't remember really which one it was. Was it gloves? No. Oh yeah, this one. There is a, once you get to uh, 95, you can start crafting the rough bronze boots. So I haven't learned that yet, but I'm gonna learn that today because I'm gonna craft some more ruined copper pants and just skill up. And making profit. So basically, I'm profiting for free. I, like, I'm scaling up while having a profit. So, to my understanding, you can pretty much do this with every single wallet supply to a very high level. So, like, try to, like, look what kind of items do the actually, the, the actual, like, profession have. And can you skill it to max level? But yeah, that's just a small tip that you can do. And it, it's super simple. I mean, from level 5, I'm pretty sure that you can get to 30 to, to 75. But I mean, if you have a, like, I don't know, an alt and you haven't really choose, chosen anything, go with blacksmithing as an alt. I highly recommend it. I've had it on my Warlock in the past, but I dropped it because... It doesn't really fit with the Warlock. So, yeah. Just a small tip. I hope you see in the future. Or maybe click in this video over here. And I would highly recommend... Well, highly appreciate if you would like, comment and subscribe on the videos. And click this video. And I'll see you over there. Pork, pork.